Wait, stop. Hold on. Hey guys, Tim Rose back again to talk about Reunion Blues cases. I've been an artist for Reunion Blues for about four years now, and the last time I made a video, I was talking about the Voyager Continental case, which is uh, to my left. This actual case I've had for about a year, and I've probably been on a plane 20 times this year. Only had to check it once. I think the real beauty of this case, it looks soft, even though it's got the plastic plate inside. TSA and the airlines, they never really mess with me and I, I pretty much always get to put it overhead. So I love this case because people... That's it? That's all we get? You want your reunion break now? Oh, this is sad. You don't need me? I gave you treats four minutes ago. All right, fine, I'm gonna call your agent. Um, I will hold this dog here against its will while I do this testimonial. What is that, a mono case? You barking at a mono case? <laughs> As I was saying before I was so rudely interrupted, these cases are great. I've had this case for a long time. I've flown with it everywhere. Reunion Blues has come out with a new product that I'm excited to tell you about. This is the Voyager Continental Double electric guitar case. The last time I did a Reunion Blues testimonial, I was living in Hawaii and I was flying all over the place, inner island for weddings and corporate events and stuff. But since then, I have relocated to LA and I've been in LA for about seven months I'm doing way more session work. The good thing about the double case is that obviously there's more than one guitar, I got options. So I went to a session last night in Beverly Hills. I was able to bring two guitars to give the engineer options. That's always a great thing. And it's still, it's not much bigger than the acoustic case. So we've got my Strat in the front and my Riggio Tango in the back. So let's, let's open this thing up. Quinn, I'm gonna stuff you in it. You ready? You're going in the guitar case. You ready? Get in the case. We rehearsed this. You're supposed to get in the case and then smile. No? So I obviously love this case. I've used it for a long time. Had it for about a year. There's no fraying on the handle. There's nothing really wrong with it. Had plenty of airport staff touch this thing. So now I put this in the back. There's two, double the fun. Still got the neck strap, still got the cushion for the end pins, and you still got the hide the straps, the zipper pocket for that, super important. Front side looks just like a Voyager case. You still have the plastic plate in the front. You still have the exact same pocket as the other Voyager case. Tons of space for cables, capos, sheet music that you can't read because you're a guitar player. Um, yeah. Perfect. I love this case. This thing is pretty much the same size as the Continental Voyager acoustic case. So really not much of a size difference. It's very light, especially with two guitars in it. I have no problem putting this thing on my back. And just as a reference, there's the Voyager case, the single electric case, and the double electric case. So I'm really excited to take this thing everywhere. I love repping these cases. If you get the chance, I would really give these cases a shot. I don't think that you'll be disappointed. I have used these cases only for like four years and nothing's ever broken. They're well made. I think they're worth the money. So, peace. Chicken grease. Buy the case. Thanks for watching my video. I hope this was useful to you in some way. If you're interested in any of the products that I talk about in this video or any other products that I use at my live shows, either for solo looping or playing in the studio or playing with a band, I'm gonna have links in the description of this gear that I talked about. And if you click it, then I get like a tiny chunk of money if you end up buying it. So support independent artists. Thank you for watching and we'll see you next time.